Folks, how is it going? It's Dom here and welcome to Ark Survival. So before we get into the episode itself, I want to thank you guys for the amazing support you are showing for this series. I am completely surprised by the amount of attention and love this series is getting. I, I really appreciate it and uh, I invite you to do the same for this video. If you enjoy it, remember to leave a like, subscribe, tell a friend, share the video if you guys want. Well, let's get into the episode itself now. If you guys have watched the episode 21 and 22 of this series, you probably know what I am about to do. I have made my preparations, I have crafted a spino saddle, I have also crafted enough structures to place a trap, and I've actually found a spinosaur in the... I'll show you guys on the map, on here. You guys can see the blue dot on the map. Um, I have not yet checked its level, but regardless, I just want to go and tame it. But there is one small problem. I've noticed that this place is filled with hostile creatures. And as you guys can see, there is a Titan of Boar right here, which I completely annihilated. Um, well, that's uh, also the reason why I brought with me an Argentavis instead of any other ordinary uh, dinosaur. It's because she has a huge amount of attack power and she can attack from a distance, so I don't have to run into any trouble. Anyway, um, I think this is the time to set up the trap and hopefully it will work. I mean, I'm, I will give it my best and hopefully it will work because, come on, I really want a Spinosaur. It's, the Spinosaur is my favorite dinosaur ever. And I can see the Spinosaur going a little bit over. Mm, I heard that the Spinosaurs um, actually get distracted very easily. So I have to be careful. Anyway, I feel like this is the perfect spot to actually place the trap. Is it far? No, it's not far. It's not that far. Alright, see, this is gonna be a 3 times 3 trap. So, you guys are gonna see which trap I'm talking about in a second, and I hopefully will not uh, screw this up in any way, because that's that's like the second time I'm actually placing a trap, and I just hope that nothing goes wrong. Alright, uh, it's a three walls high, by the way. Uh, oh, there's a Belza Buffo. Uh, that those are not hostile. I mean, hopefully they're not. Okay, there we go. One here, one here, 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 and no, wait. I've installed S uh, plus, by the way, as you guys can see. It's a super useful mo uh, mod. Oh no, he's too close. Is definitely too close. Not yet, Spino. Not yet, Spino. So, I'm gonna place the entrance. I'm gonna place the entrance over here. I'm just gonna place the entrance over here because that's probably the, the easiest thing I can do. I hopefully have not forgotten to bring any walls with me. That would be a real shame. And I found out that at my expense, Spinosaurs are really, really, really tall. They are, like, really big. Alright, that's where the, the traps are going. Alright, so time to place the ramp. No, 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 not yet, Spino. Not yet, Spino. I'm gonna place them over here, and I'm gonna... I'm gonna round them up. There we go. Spino, stay away, my friend. Uh, you guys probably know that I'm super anxious when it comes to, you know, teaming in such a high, um, high level environment. Wait. There it. There we go. 
one here and two last pillars will go over it's gonna take me three hours why won't it fit re okay, we're just gonna pretend it will fit there we go there we go okay uh, it's almost done spinosaur it's almost done almost done hang over there okay uh, there is no way to actually uh, put a ramp over here so we're gonna try without it we're just gonna try and jump so I think that we are ready to get its attention really easy and simple did it work did it work did it yes it did all right here we go he's actually stuck you guys can see that this is my first trap working it's legit my first trap that actually works i don't know if you guys remember the one with the tyrannosaurus rex and it actually went pretty bad if you guys remember it went terrible uh, but I was able to tame the Tyrannosaurus nonetheless, and I'm really happy about it. Uh, so that totally worked out for me. But this time, this time the trap actually worked, and that's amazing. Let me know if you guys liked the way that I placed the trap, even though I know that I could have maybe um, adjusted it a tad bit, but, but it's completely fine. So if you guys want a few tips, uh, do not shoot it in the head because that's where he will get most damage and he will probably die if he starts bleeding too much. And he should be about to fall asleep. And you guys can use this video as a guide, kind of. Uh, if you're trying to tame a Spinosaur, just like I am doing. I think he's starting to run away. I don't think he realizes that he cannot break the trap. Alright, it's almost done, almost done. Now, one hit and he will probably kill me. Anyway, if you guys are um, following this video, Remember that I will do a Narc Survival Extinction stream probably sometimes next week, uh, in the weekend, probably. So remember to tune in, check out my channel, and if you are not subscribed already, remember to do so. Alright, so I have prepared some food for him and some narcotics in case he wakes up. There we go, he's level 120. That's super amazing. He's gonna be like 150 maybe after the taming and ends. Not sure. We will see. And there we go, the Spinosaur is finally tamed. Um, I think I'm gonna name it something stupid like uh, Spiky Lizard. Yeah, Spiky Lizard will do. Uh, anyway, I'm gonna grab anything around me because that's gonna be useful later, probably. And yeah, I'm just taking advantage of that S plus mod, mostly. Thank you guys for suggesting it. It's been really useful. Anyway, I wanted to give the Spinosaur a try uh, since, uh, you know, that's the, the first time ever I get to explore and see his abilities. So the first thing I notice is that when he's on the water, uh, he seems to get a speed buff. Um, that's really good. And as you guys can see on the top right of the screen, even when he gets out of the water, he gets a short burst of speed buff. Um, I, th I believe it's, it's around 30 seconds or something. And he appears to also have two kind of combat stances. One for legs and one with two legs. He seems to be really good at both. I think that the main purpose of the Spinosaur is to gather fish meat. Correct me if I'm wrong, guys. 
And anyway, that's it for this episode. Uh, remember to leave a like and subscribe to the channel if you have not subscribed yet. Uh, tell a friend, share it with your friends. And if you guys have any suggestion for me for the next video, if you want, uh, if you want to, uh, I don't know, tame, uh, see something bigger like a Gigantosaurus or something, I'll see what I can do. And tell me in the comment section and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.